Well, I gotta say, you guys are the hardcore of the hardcore. Yeah, there's a little bit of discussion. There's only a few people in here. Should we do it? And then we all realized, you know what? Even if there was just one of you in here, that one person deserves a good time. Because you're sitting there waiting for this movie to start, and you want to see all these people that were in it. And, 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 and you're all so damned cute. You really are. <laughs> The guy with the beard's really cute. Yeah, I like you, dude. What's up? I like the beard. <laughs> Don't let him wake you. Guys, thank you for sticking around. Let me introduce to you now the cast and crew of Friday the 13th Part 5, A New Beginning. I don't remember Director Danny Steinman. Come on up, man. Carol Locatel. John Shepard. Shepard is next to me. Scared me. Dick Leon's already sitting down, baby. Ron Sloan. Siobhan Ross. Jason himself, Mr. Tom Morgan. The man with the best hair in the whole damn movie, Miguel Nunez. Take it away, guys. We want to thank you all for coming out tonight. And you guys in the back, you can move up forward. Okay? He's running for mayor too, actually. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Daddy, say something. Just tell him a couple words. Uh, it's 25 years later, and uh, Friday 4 was uh, supposed to be the last film in the series, but the film made a lot of money. Like <laughs> <laughs> about $25 million. Uh, <clears throat> Paramount made the money. And uh, so they tried to figure out a way because Jason, you know, was dead dead in the movie 4. And, uh, but they made this money, like uh, 24, $25 million, number five made even more, a couple million dollars more. <clears throat> but, so why they made that money is after uh, they paid uh, the exhibitor 15 to 25%, films cost them like $2 million, which was a low budget film. Today it's like 15 to 25 million dollars. That's the cost of an actor. You know, an actor that paid. But Cleopatra. Not those days. In those days. Cleopatra <laughs> almost cost the studio. It was 20th century. <laughs> the whole, you know, Elizabeth Taylor, 60 hours kept on going on and on. <clears throat> but eventually they made that back, 25 million dollars. So, uh, anyway, after the. Uh, you paid for the exhibitor, the theater owner, which was 15 to 30 percent, say. Paramount clears 15 to 22 million dollars, and they didn't want to throw that away. So uh, they decided not to bring Jason back, but to turn Tommy into uh, Jason. And uh, the Henry treatment, which was not very good. And I came back, I gave them something. And so finally they, they went ahead and did it. So this is what this movie is. You know, a way to keep the movie alive, which they completely erased in number six. Uh, but it is what it is, and I hope you, hope you enjoy it. I do want to say that I'm just coming here today and seeing uh, this thriving group of people that I, that I worked with. It's a real, it's very touching to me, and uh, uh, they're all successful and happy, and uh, it's very nice to be here. So I hope you enjoy the film. Uh, I don't know if it holds up, but I'm, I'm curious to see. <laughs> <laughs> so, anybody else want to say something? So let's take a look. Thank <laughs> you.